Hey, what's up guys? My name is Joe. And a couple months ago, we did a, uh, started a viral hair product testing thing and we featured some hair wax that could temporarily color your hair until you uh, take a shower and wash it out. Now that was a fun video to put together. If you uh, didn't check that out, you can find that linked up here. I got some serious color out of those products. Today we're testing out a couple more uh, viral hair product trends and that is hair color spray. It's still a hair coloring product, but this time in the form of a spray. So we're gonna go buy some, we're gonna test it out, see how well it colors your hair. Uh, like how does it feel, how does it work and how well does it wash out. Um, but mo most importantly is how well does it color your hair? That's what I'm interested in. Let's go check it out. All right, so we've got three different hair color sprays. Uh, we've got gray, we've got turquoise, and we've got fiery red. And I'm gonna be testing out two different brands to see if there's a difference. So let's take this back to the office throw it in and uh, get colorful. Let's go. All right, cool. We're back at the office. So here's the dealio. I have damp hair, came back with damp hair. I'm gonna blow dry my hair as uh, I normally do. So I'm gonna go ahead, throw in some original, uh, get that structure in place, get that control in place, get that hold in place. <laughs> So here's the deal, I'm not gonna go for like my normal uh, put together quiff hairstyle. The point of this video is to see, you know, how these sprays can color my hair. So I'm just gonna kind of blow dry it. I'm trying to get volume so we can see the color but not necessarily make it look perfect. So I'm just gonna kind of go crazy with the blow dryer, get my hair in the air. look half bad a little bit messy a little bit long forward quiff thing going on such a fun video to make i love it i love this i love it so much you know why because we're adding cavalier into the mix cavalier is like the life of the party it's not about the style today it's about getting the hair in the air all right all right this is very johnny bravo but we're gonna go with that. All right, <clears throat> we're at the moment you've all been waiting for. We're gonna start off with the first brand. This is Schwarz to Kauf, right here. Uh, we're gonna go with gray first because gray is the most normal, I would say. Some people get gray highlights. I mentioned in a video that I might get gray, gray highlights. I don't know yet. Uh, I guess we're gonna experiment with this and see what happens. Basically, the idea behind this stuff is it's supposed to provide you temporary color and you're not meant to be able to feel it that much that mu that much and you're not meant to be and you're not meant to be able to feel it that much much uh, that's why it's in spray form and it should be able to wash out really easily so we're going to just see how well or how much color we can get from a spray color product <laughs> smell that man this is like full, full on builders work site let me see what we've got here so far is it Ooh, that's very wet wait is this glitter okay so what i'm getting so far is that uh first of all kind of like the hair color wax that we used a while ago to start getting the effect you have to use a lot of this stuff second of all <clears throat> probably poisonous it's in my throat right now it's in josh's throat probably in ben's throat as well third of all it sprays in wet you gotta leave it a bit to dry down so we're gonna add a little bit more See if we can get some more gray in there. <coughs> Can't speak. <coughs> All right, so I feel like I've used about probably around half the bottle. This is what my hair's looking like. I mean, you can see some gray in there. I think I probably prefer the hair coloring wax a little bit more. So far, we still have a couple more to test. Come on, get more silver. I just need to breathe for a second. Poisonous gas over there. All right, five minutes later, spend some time in recovery. This is kind of what we're left with right now. So far, we've only used the gray. It's, it's, you gotta use a lot of it. To be honest, I kind of like the effect. It is on the glittery side though, which it, uh, I don't know how well it comes across on camera. It's not supposed to be glittery, but it kind of 
is, but I kind of like the color at the same time. So far, I'm gonna say that I think there's better methods if you want some color in your hair, like that hair color wax video, uh, for example. But hey, I've got some red now, so I'm gonna do some layering. I've got my silver, I'm gonna throw in some red. Bless you. Ooh, that one came through right away. The red one, way more effective. It's pretty much just put the same amount of color as the silver and I've only, I've used like about 5% of the silver that I used. Uh, I mean, I've already done this, so let's go ahead and just layer it loads. So I gotta say that the red has uh, definitely turned out better than the silver. I don't know if it has to do with the formula or what, but the red has come through way more um, clearly. It's not, it's more like a, it's like an orangey mixed with red, kind of like a rusty color, as Josh pointed out. So this sprays in pretty wet, but it hardens up, or it doesn't harden up, but it um, dries down really quick as well. So like if I do this, I don't feel it anymore. And also it doesn't harden up quite like hairspray. It feels a little crispy, but not to the extent that hairspray does after hairspray dries up. So far, we've tried two out of the three that we've got. We've tried uh, both of them from Schwarzkopf, which means the last one that we've got is L'Oreal's Cola Rista Spray Turquoise. And I like turquoise, so I'm excited to try out this color. But I'm not gonna layer it. I'm gonna go wash out my hair. We'll get back and uh, try this one out. So I'm back once again, this time with, uh, well, damp hair again, because I just washed it out. So now we are going to repeat the process like we did at the beginning of the video. You take a little bit, you take just a little bit like this, perfect amount, all right? And you do like this, you just spread a little bit. You do like this, this is called emulsification. Young boys and girls and old boys and women. Same thing as before, we're just gonna get, uh, get my hair into the air, spray it down. You guys know the drill by now. This time around, guys, we're switching things up. We're not using Cavalier, we're using Hybrid, which has a bear on it and is also a clay product, but this has a light to medium hold. So for those of you who don't need something so thick and drastic like Cavalier, this is an excellent, excellent alternative. Also, look at that creamy breakdown. Very nice. Wow, so easy and creamy, guys. And check this out. Whoa, that was an accident. Didn't mean to put it all right there in my fridge. <laughs> but what I was trying to show you is it goes in so easily. It's like I can't even feel any tug or pull at all. <laughs> Great, it's all right here now. There, now if you want to look like this, buy hybrid. There. Okay. okay, basically you get the point. My hair's in the air now. Uh, we're gonna go in with the final product. This is by L'Oreal, switching brands a little bit. One thing to notice, it's a smaller amount for a similar price. So think about that when you're by, about to purchase a hairspray that colors. light in there to be able to see that. Oh gosh. I'm trapped. Okay. Hey, okay. I can see it now. I see what we're dealing with. You see what we're dealing with? This is what we're dealing with. Oh, well, I just added silver. I thought this was the blue one. <clears throat> Whatever. There doesn't seem to be much of a difference between the two different brands. They both feel the same, they both, yeah, they kind of act very similar to one another. The blue, like the silver, took a long time for it to show up in terms of how long you need to spray your hair for it to come through. Uh, app, but once again, kind of like the gray. Now that I've got it all there, I think it looks pretty cool. The only thing is you just have to use a ton of it. So if you are okay with that, then you might like this for, once again, special occasions. Halloween, birthday parties. Easter, you wanna color your hair for Easter? That's coming up very soon. We've got just the product for you, check it out down below. So to conclude, it works. It's just that you have to use a lot of it 
and you have to be okay with the fact that you won't be able to breathe for about five minutes after applying the stuff unless of course you do it outside which i would recommend do it somewhere where you've got a lot of air somewhere where you can you know freely move around so you don't <clears throat> suffocate to death other than that if you're okay with the amount that you have to use you get decent results and it hasn't really messed with the hold of my hair with the other products that i've used uh, it hasn't really taken the hold down <laughs> I've got some blue. It hasn't really decreased that hold. It hasn't really added to the hold. If you guys missed the hair coloring wax video, um, I think that stuff might be, you know, I probably prefer that stuff a little bit better. Check it out up here in this corner. Uh, go watch it and uh, you know, it's like this, except with hair color wax. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. I'll see everybody next time.